Weather Nation is ready in your community for extreme weather, water, and climate events. Helping build a weather-ready nation. Proud to be a Weather Ready Nation ambassador. We're back. It's another edition of Weather Ready Nation here on Weather Nation. I'm John Van Pelt, and this week we're looking at Earth from space. In 2016, NOAA and NASA launched the first in a new series of incredible weather satellites, the GOES-R series. That spacecraft, GOES-16, is now NOAA's GOES-East, and in 2018, GOES-S went on orbit as our new GOES-West satellite. The next big step in this series is GOES-T, scheduled to launch on Tuesday. Adrian Quadra from Lockheed Martin talks about how important these satellites are for all of us. GOES is really about protecting life and property. So everything we do is about how do we make it easier for forecasters to be able to help the decision makers uh, make the decisions faster and better, right? So if we're talking about a hurricane and it's coming up the coast, where is it going to go? When is it going to get there? What are the places that we have to evacuate? What are the places that we may not have to? And so knowing as soon as possible and knowing with um, really good good accuracy where the hurricane's going to go um, is really going to help us make those decisions. And when it comes to severe thunderstorms and tornadoes, the GOES satellite's instruments give us life-saving data we didn't have before. We have the geostationary lightning mapper, the GLM instrument, and so that really is measuring uh, lightning and lightning intensity. And so, as you know, lightning is one of the first indicators of severe weather. So now, now having this data, we get a lot earlier indication of any severe weather that's coming through. And an amazing example of how important the GLM instrument is happened last year when severe thunderstorms moved into Alabama. A lot of the uh, ground radars were off. Um, and offline, and actually using only the GLM data, they were able to accurately predict that a tornado was going to hit, and within 17 minutes of lead time, um, they actually sounded the tornado warnings, um, and then an EF2 tornado actually came down and hit one of the elementary schools there. From detecting wildfires from space to giving us amazing views of weather systems on Earth and in space, the Gozar series weather satellites will continue to be life-saving tools well into the 2030s. We'll have the latest on the Goes T's launch and deployment right here on Weather Nation and at WeatherNationTV.com. I'm John Van Pelt. Join us again next week for another edition of Weather Ready Nation.